Hello YouTube, this is Chain Scott, and today I'm going to be starting a new series called Map Making Mondays, or I'm going to be calling it M3 for short. And the way I'm going to be doing this is hopefully every Monday, if not every other Monday, I will be posting a video with an update on a map that I will be making. Henceforth, the name Map Making Mondays. Okay, the first video will be a little uh, introduction. I'll explain what that is, that's uh, some viewer participation. And I'll explain what all this thing is on the floor. Now, to begin with, this is the world spawn point directly in the middle of these four lapis blocks. With the, with the world spawn point, I can do two things. One is identify the area that the players will spawn in, which is the big white um, quartz area and the second thing is is to identify where the spawn chunks are which is all of this cyan and, teal, uh, cyan and magenta wall. To identify where the spawn chunks actually are you take the chunk that the world spawn point is in so which is this red one and you need to identify the center of a 12 by 12 chunk um, sorry my phone just went off a 12 by 12 chunk area now the center of it will be the north west corner which is in between here that's why I have these four as red and yellow to identify the center now I did say a 12 by 12 area for the spawn chunks but this is only 6 by 6 at the minute just so I have a, a small amount of space to begin work with um, the reason I've done this is because in spawn chunks they are continuously loaded in Minecraft and it doesn't matter how far away you go. I could run a hundred thousand blocks that way and the redstone in here would still work. Um, which it will help a lot in map making. Um, but yeah, that's what I've done so far. So the second part of this video is the user uh, viewer participation and that is to decide what kind of map to build a minigame map, an adventure map, or a PvP map. Now, when I, when you vote for which kind of map that I make, I would like you to take into consideration that I would like to use not like an incredibly large, unbelievable amount of redstone, but I would like to use quite a bit. Um, the reason I'm doing this is to get used to the set block commands and at the same time give you guys something to watch and for you to have a say in which is why I'll be doing uh, the viewer participation on every video or aim to do it on every video so let me explain these a bit minigame what I mean by that is fr examples of minigame maps are things like the dropper or zombie terror defense or the map that Disco made where it was two pirate ships shooting at each other something along the lines of that but I would like to have an original idea and what I mean by that is I don't want to copy somebody else's previous idea I'd like to um, make an entirely new thing so if you have any ideas leave those in the comments below um, for an adventure map um, what I'd like you to say is a theme so you could say space or you could say western something like that. Uh, also give me some ideas of storylines, all that stuff and then I'll put that into the map if this one gets chosen. And the last one is a PvP map. In the past I have built a PvP map called Castle Battles which is a capture and control point uh, game type but um, if you do choose me to do a PvP map I'm not going to do a simple team deathmatch because that's really simple, it won't use a lot of redstone and it'll be done quite quickly. Then, so what I would like to do is an objective type map you can tell me themes, what kind of objectives you would like to use and all that stuff. But an additional thing to the PvP map is I would like to give it a bit more uh, complexness into it, so what I mean by that is for an example, in MOBA types games such as League of Legends, Dota, Smite, Han, all those type of games, they have uh, 
an extra score in when you kill millions and other players you get gold to spend on items to either make you stronger give you more defense give you more lifesteal speed whatever that is um, and I would like to have something um, not exactly the same as that but something similar in a PvP game just to give it that bit of an extra spice to it and just generally um, give me a bit more redstoning to do and that about covers it so um, leave a like on this video um, if you are interested in this series and it does help me so please do it leave a comment of what you think I should build um, the minigame adventure map or PvP and remember to subscribe to stay tuned for this more from this series coming soon and for the rest of the videos on my channel uh, so thanks for watching and goodbye